Hello out there, welcome to this tutorial on application of integral calculus. In this video, we'll be looking at the area under a curve. So we have the problem here. Calculate the area of the finite region enclosed by the curve y equal to x squared minus 3x plus 2 and the line y equal to 5 minus x. So in our solution to this problem, we look at it as we have a curve then a line such that the area here between the curve and the line this shaded region is what we are calculating its area it's just a demonstration this is not the actual sketch of the curve so to do that we are going to equate the two equations to find a new equation which will give us the solution of the intersection of these two points to enable us get our upper and the lower limit, then create the definite integrals and evaluate. So we go ahead, x squared minus 3x plus 2 is equal to 5 minus x. We collect the like terms. This is going to give us x squared minus 2x because this minus 3x, this minus x coming to this side becomes minus 3x plus x which gives minus 2x then this is plus 2 this 5 coming here becomes plus 2 minus 5 which will now give us minus 3 is equal to 0 we can then solve this quadratic equation to give us our values for x which we represent the upper and the lower limits so we have um, x plus 1 x minus 3 is equal to 0 where x is negative 1 and x is 3. So we go ahead to find the area now. So the area now will be integral from negative 1 to 3. That's the lower limit and the upper limit. And uh, our new function is going to be x squared minus 2x minus 3 dx. We evaluate this to give us our area. Um, integrating this, we are going to have it as x3 over 3. Then if we integrate this, this is going to be 2x squared divided by 2, giving us x squared. So we have minus x squared. This one is going to give us 3x minus 3x, then from negative 1 to 3. We then substitute the upper limit. That's going to give us 3 raised to the power 3 over 3 minus 3 squared minus 3 times 3 that's the upper limit then minus we substitute in the lower limit negative 1 squared divided by 3 minus negative 1 squared minus 3 times negative 1 we simplify this is going to give us um, 9 27 divided by 3 is 9 then minus 9 then also minus 9 then minus we simplify the lower limit this is negative 1 over 3 then minus 1 negative 3 times negative 1 gives plus 3 so if we simplify this we are going to have 9 minus 9 gone we are left with negative 9 then minus 1 2 over 3 because minus 1 plus 3 gives 2 so 2 minus 1 over 3 gives 1 2 over 3 so we have it this is minus 9 minus 1 2 over 3 will give us minus 10 2 over 3 so our area now cannot be negative so we take the absolute value of this so that our final value for the area is 10 2 over 3 square units and that's all for the solution of this problem and this is where we are ending this tutorial thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it please like and share this video also remember to subscribe to our youtube channel until we come your way again goodbye